Hello guys, welcome along to a gameplay video and um, I'm going to be looking at an Xbox 360 game called Bully. Um, and this is just a game that I just recently picked up for the Xbox 360 and I was, I've got it on the PlayStation 2 and also on the Wii. Now if you've got this game on the PlayStation 2, it's not called Bully, it's called the Canis Canem Edit. This is obviously Latin, which I didn't know, but it's Latin for dog eat dog. I just found out a wee bit of information out tonight, actually. Um, yeah, so here we go. So it was released, obviously, by Rockstar. It was a Rockstar game. Uh, Rockstar Vancouver released the game for the PlayStation 2 back in 2006. And then it did say they were making an Xbox version. I've always wondered why there wasn't one, but it was cancelled for some reason. Um, two years later, 2008, they re-released the game and called it Bully the Scholarship Edition uh, for the Xbox 360 and the Nintendo Wii. So that was in 2008 and also on the PC. Um, okay, so it's, it's an open world game, open adventure game set in a sentence of a school, Bullworth Academy. Think of, I don't know, Grand Theft Auto, but it's in a school. So you've got your 15 year old character who's Jimmy, Jimmy Hopkins, that's your, the main character that you, you control. At the very start of the game, <laughs> the story is his mother is on her sixth marriage and um, the husband is old enough to be Jimmy's grandfather, so he can't be bothered with him and drops him off at the school. Um, so this Cry, boarding school. Girl. Now Jimmy has been oh, expelled from out. all the other schools that he's been at. <laughs> Here comes so this Jimmy. is um, just knock it off, this Gary. Is him getting You're out of line. Put oh, into I'm a boarding sorry. school. I didn't um, realize I was hanging out in the girls' dorm. Silly I just left me. it at the gates. That's the best argument. Just left it at the You're gates. Boring. Left it on me. Boring. Um, and I'm it opens up like a Grand Theft Auto game. So obviously you've got You're your kind of main story, yourself, and then you've friend. got all these other branches off that you can help certain people, <laughs> and they're marked on the map. Um, like you do with the Grand Theft Auto games, so you can actually I'm go sorry, through the main story if you, you want, or help I apologize, other, okay? Um, I just get a little overexcited. Kind of side missions, Forgive and it's me. all mini games. Forget it. It's cool. You end up going to anyway, class, so you're doing different I've class. I've got a good idea for some um, fun. Let's go out and uh, tour. Biology. Really I've done a bit of biology, which you'll see at the end of this video. This I've done a bit of P. Uh, uh, um, come on. There's also this other parts you can do. Um, a lot of fighting you in the game. Come on, you can actually, I'm sorry. if you're walking into fort, you can you end up getting into want? a fight Shut with it, actually meaning it. Then come meaning to, on. Um, it's a very, very fun game. Because they've got this unusual setting of being at the school. So it's not a massive, massive area. You do eventually, I believe, fun. get to explore the town later on. But at the start of the game, you're just in the confines of the school. So you've got the, you've got your bill, your bills. You've got your boys uh, sleeping area, which you get shown. You've got your own room. That's obviously where you do your save. You've got the main school, and then you've got various outbuildings. Um, and I did read later on. Once the story unfolds, you're able to explore the town. Um, you've got various weapons. One of the weapons that's opened up to me was a like a sling, a sling hook. Um, that you're able to use, and also I'm getting taught how to fight, and different moves open up for that. So once you've learned that, you then can Where use is it. This dirty old perv. Um, you know, you're not very nice, Gary, and you're a loser, Petey. One of life's unfortunate. Girl, only, only negative <laughs> aspect of the game. I mean, so this I game did get high ratings. Through, Jimmy. Your dad does um, this. Oh, I mean, I'm looking at you. Look at the Metacritic score. Let's leave this guy who's welfare payments. 360 version has got 18 out, out of 100. Based, that's based on 56 Just get out of here, kid. So 80 out of 100 is a really good score. Um, and the PlayStation 2 version yeah, did get a higher story. mark. I mean, we're talking 87 ago. No, so 15. An extremely yeah. high mark for Metacritic. No. Then why shouldn't I kill um, you? All right then, tough guy. Kill me. And that was based on 69 critics, 69 <laughs> reviews. A lot of them gave you know it um, what, 100. I like your style. You've full got marks. Guts. 
When I was on that That's a very fun career, game. Watching my buddies get killed the by only fire, I negative used aspect I would find like you? Yeah? is uh, it's the loading times. But I bet you can't fight. And it's not you exactly the loading favor, times are extremely long. It's show just some that real moves. the loading times. Classified moves. Real special every time you walk stuff. through a door, cool. every time you walk through the front door, you get a part for my radio and I'll show you what the army does. You then got like a little bit of a loading time. Exactly. Same when you're leaving the door, and through all these doors, you're constantly getting a loading time. Now, I did read that if I installed it onto my hard drive, it would cut a lot of them down, so a lot faster. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to load it into my Xbox well, and um, see if that would not do anything. It is really starting to get onto me because I just want to play the game. I just want to continue with the story, and, and, and I'm, you seem to be sitting there and waiting, looking at the loading screens. This game also has been out for a while. I mean, like I said, it came out in 2008. So you're talking five years it's been out nearly. Yet the price of the game is still quite high to buy. Um, you know, it's usually around about the £30 mark. Looking on eBay, just before I've done this video, the prices seem to have come down a wee bit, so you are talking about the £20 mark. A wee while ago, about a year ago, I was, well, not even a year ago, when I started collecting for the Xbox 360, they all seemed to go for £25 to £30 pound a game, but £20 mark, it looks like the average price. Some folk are lucky and got it for a tenner, but most folk, um, it's usually about £20 mark. Now, the game does come with a map, and I'm going through the eBay's, I'm talking to you here, and the ones that are going cheaper don't have the map. I mean, look at the one here, 1950, no map with it. It's got a manual, but no map. Uh, you do need the map, well, you do need the map. You don't need the map to see where you're going. But if you're like me, I like to have a complete game. Just like the Grand Theft Auto games on the PlayStation 2 and Xbox, I like to have the map and the manual. Um, lucky enough, I got my copy and I was able to find it in the wilderness. I didn't have to buy off eBay and it did come with a map, so I was lucky that way. Like I said, the main character of the game is, jo is Jimmy Hopkins, he's 15 year old. He, um, like I said, he's just been kind of emptied out to the, emptied out the car into That's the front trash. gate at the school. And he's, and he's kind of stuck there. Um, and it just seems that everybody is out to beat him up. And as like I said, he's, he's not got a choice, he has to fight his way through um, all these different situations. Um, and there's different other characters in the game, the head teacher's speaking to you, you've got the prefects artists, so if you think of the Grand Theft Auto where, um, because obviously you've got a trouble bar, and um, if you're meant to be in class, you've got the prefects that are going about, so you, they're meant to be like the police, so you can either run away from them, they grab you, you're busted, you're in, you're in, you're in class. Um, but it's, I think it's just a set, it's different, like if you have to have the city, and um, you know, you, you it's a school, and I feel that there is violence in here, it says that you're fighting, you you're fighting a lot, but it's not like, you know, you're not blowing people's heads off, and, um, done and, done right. <laughs> and like that. Hello, children. Welcome to the world of biology. I hope you all have strong stomachs.
Now the game when it was first released on the PlayStation 2 there was a lot of controversy. Um, I mean the title of the game, Bully. So in all different countries they um, put different certificates on it. Now in the United Kingdom the, um, there was a Labour MP who tried to get it banned or to get it reclassified as an 18. The uh, Curries and PC World refused to stock the game because it says it wasn't appropriate for their kind of family friendly image um, because they believed that there's a link between violence and children and all this kind of stuff in gaming um, but you know the stores game HMV and Virgin Mega stores they they stopped it but um, it had a 15 rating My overall ex my overall my overall view of the game is it's a fun game. It does have to me this last generation feel to the game. You know the graphics, although the setting's beautifully done in the school, close up the graphics are they exceptional. There's wee jagged edges and you know with the fingers and move but that doesn't matter. It's a it's a fun game. It's um, it's an easy game to get into. You know, it's highlighted on the map where you to go or where you can go. You've got these choices. It's a it's a fun game. Um, I've enjoyed playing it. And like I said, the only negative is that these loading times. Well, I'm going to install it onto my hard drive and see if it cuts it out. Um, and I would recommend this game if you can find this game for a good price. I mean. It's a quite a hard game to find anyway. It's not the easiest game to find, unless you buy it on eBay. But if you're in your game, your game station shut down, but if you're looking in these shops, in places where you've got pre-owned games, it's very it's very hard to find. It'd be unusual for you, for you to find it. Don't you like but if you can find open? it, I would recommend it. Get it into your collection, have a play with it. I mean, you can get the PlayStation 2 version easy, and the, the Wii version, oh, which is the nasty. same as Xbox 360, because they've added extra missions, and there is extra content in the game. Go and get it. Try it out. It is a good game. But it's fun. It's fun to play. So we're going to leave it there, and then thanks for Hopkins. watching, guys. And until next time. Cheers. Really, Hopkins, you've got to put some effort into it.